Shopify tags. Okay, are these things useful? What are Shopify tags? Why should I need it? Do I even need it? And if I need it, how should I create a Shopify tag and add to those to my products? Okay, don't worry. Okay, because in this video, I've gone in in-depth description about the Shopify tags, why you need them, how to use them, and how to use your products to add to different tags and how to use different tags so that it can increase the amount of time people want to search, amount of time duration people need to search for a particular product to, in your site, okay? So watch this video till the end to get an in-depth knowledge and in-depth about how to add and use tags features in Shopify to your own benefit, okay? So watch this video till the end to get to know about the whole process, okay? So let's get started. Okay, so you want to add tags to your products, okay? Adding tags to your products is like really, really simple, okay? Let's say we are selling, okay, let's say we are selling men, okay, men necklace, okay? But you can see nothing is appearing in the search results of our websites, okay? Like zero results, okay? But we have a product which is related to men's necklace, okay? How are people gonna find it if they search it? You have to add, tag, add the tags of those products to that particular products menu, okay? So to do that, go to products, okay? Now let's say this silver pendant is for men, okay? Now in this section, see, here's the tags option, okay? As you can see, I've already added a couple of tags, okay? Let's just do men's pendants, men's pendants, okay? You can do men's necklace, okay, and item. Okay, so as you can see, we have added two more tags to all of those tags. Now just click on save, okay, product save, the tags are added, okay. Now go to your website, okay, do men's necklace, search it again. It will appear in some time, wait. Okay, come here, do men's, see, men's. You can see, the silver pendant is appearing, okay? Men's pendant. You can see, this item start appearing, okay? And if you go, remove the tag, like men's pendant, men's necklace, save. You can see, okay? Wait for some time. Reload the page. Wait a second. Okay, let's search it again. Okay, men's. Come here. Okay. Men's. We save it or not. Yeah, yeah, men's pendant, pendant is not here. Men's pendant is appearing. Wait a second. Yeah, yeah. Now, now you can, can see the option is gone, okay? It takes some time to load, okay? As we have, like, you can see we have removed the tag from here, so it's not showing over here, okay? So whenever you are adding the products to your website, try to add related tags to them, okay? So that if someone comes to the website for a particular product and you have like a couple of products, like even if the product in like is, you have like categorized the product for like men's pendant, okay? But there's the name for, let's say it's a rose gold pendant, okay? And you have like 23 pendants on the pendant section, okay? So if someone wants to just search it, so if they can just search it from here, like rose gold pendant, so you have to add all of those like keywords, like tags, so that whenever someone searches it, it's gonna display in front of them, okay? So this is how usually you can use the tag feature and add tag to your products and how useful it is to add tag to your website, okay? I hope you found this video useful. As I already just said, this video is the part of a Shopify series in which I am taking you on a journey from creating your own Shopify store to adding products, to advertising, to making real profit. 
so to get notified when i upload my next video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon button to get notified when i upload my video thank you very much